what is happening everybody out there uh so check this out eric Meehan out of san diego keller williams in la jolla we've been talking for quite a while let me mute this right quick and uh he's out there he's part of the zero to diamond program he's been watching me for how long now eric about a month okay about, he's probably, about six weeks probably he's only been in real estate since january yeah so uh brand new to real estate in general and um anyway he's reached out to me and we're wondering do do my phone scripts work everywhere that's what we're going to try to find out today they work where you're working they're going to see if we're working in san diego right right so that's that's what we're doing so i'm actually going to call people in san diego in eric's market all right um so let's give it a second for some people to log on Eric, um, tell me what kind of problems you've been having with uh, with the calls, or or how people have been receiving you, and and why you feel like, or I don't even know if you feel like my scripts don't work over there, but just kind of tell me what's going on. So, you know, transparently, you know, I haven't made eight hundred calls a day, but I try to make two or three hours, two or three times a week. And I get a lot of, you know, answering uh, uh, machines. So, you know, I'm going to start doing them in the evening next week, uh, two nights a week. I'm okay. going to start that because I do open houses Saturdays and Sundays. Um, but the people that I talk to just haven't been very receptive. I mean, I'm only getting, you know, out of talking to 20 or 30 people, you know, maybe in a day after all the dials or if I get that many, I'm only getting one or two uh, emails. You know, I'm only right. having, having some conversations, but they're just not interested. Okay. I don't know whether it's they're just getting hammered here or, you know, what it is or it's me. Well, I can probably go ahead and tell you it's you, you know, um, <laughs> because of your lack of experience. It's the lack of experience. You've only been doing this for a couple of months. So, I mean, you know, it took me eight months to make my first sale. And that was, of course, doing it the hard way. Like I didn't have Ricky telling me what to say, how to say it, all that good stuff. Right. But, um, you know, you're light years ahead of me in that perspective. But but literally, man, like how many calls have you made total, like in your whole three three month career? Well, I don't know, a couple thousand, maybe. OK, OK, yeah, okay. probably a couple thousand because I do my sphere and I have some other lists and things that I've been calling. So, yeah. Yeah. OK, cool. Uh, let's see. Just trying to get things all set up here. Okay, cool. Well, um, let's see. Give it a few more seconds for some more people to log on because I know a lot of people probably want to see this. Um, let's see. Let's see. Uh -oh. Let's see. Let's schedule. Let's do now. Okay. Boom. Boom. Okay. Getting all geared up, guys. All geared up. So right now it is 413 in my area. It is 213 where you are, right, Eric? That is correct. Okay, so let me explain to you guys exactly how we're doing this before we get going. And this will give people some more time to log in to watch as I make the calls, but what we're doing is, is Eric has the uh, Mojo single line dialer. And so what he's doing is he's got his, his contacts in the single line dialer and he's called, he is, he is logged in. He has his phone. He's, he's called in, put the password in. And then he three wayed me in on the call and he's muted his phone. Okay. So the number will show up as Eric's number on the caller ID, but I will be the one talking on Eric's behalf. When the prospect answers, I am, I am basically Eric's assistant. I'm Ricky Carruth with Eric Meehan's. Is it Meehan? Meehan. Meehan. I can't get that down. That's I'm right. Ricky Carruth with Eric Meehan's uh, office at Keller Williams, La Jolla. Um, so that's going to that's gonna be how I represent this situation. I'm basically Eric's ISA for the day. Um, Couldn't have a better one. That's how we're going to do that. 
All right. Cool. So let's let her fly. I say it's time to make some calls. Uh, he sent me the list of people, so I have their name. I know uh, what property they own. He also sent me the comp that he's using for this, so I know what the property is. I've got that in front of me here. I'm only using one comp. I don't know the area. I don't know nothing. Let's do this. Let me know when it's dialing. It hung up on me. Yep, I saw that. I'm going to call you back real quick. Sorry about that. It was all okay. ready to go. Okay. Okay. You there? I'm there. All right, I'm going to add a, add a call. Sorry, I'm going to get it going. I'm going to make calls out of state today. Not that I don't make calls out of state all the time because all my clients are from all over the country. But um, yeah, I want to do this little experiment, call some homeowners in another area. You are now locked into the Mojo Dollar. Please press the start button on your screen to begin calling. All right. Tell me when you're ready. I'm ready. Here we go. It'll be Larry. Do this, do this. <clears throat> Hello. Hey, Miss Cohen. Hello. Hey, Miss Miss Cohen. Who is this? This is Ricky Caruth down at Eric Meehan's office at Keller Williams, La Jolla. How you doing? Yeah, I'm fine. Oh, good. Yeah, I'm just enjoying what's, the day. What's up? Oh, nothing much. I didn't want to take too much of your time. There was a house around the corner that just sold from you guys. Didn't know if there's anything in the world I could do for y'all. Oh, no. We um, we are staying here till they carry us out. Till they carry you out. The building crumbles. Right. Okay. Right. Well, that sounds okay. good to me. Hey, Thanks anyway. You have your good day. Bye now. Okay, the next one is Weeder. Yeah. Let's do it. That was She's a very a, classic example of what happens. Well, and also you're calling in a 55 and up community. So, I mean, go figure, right? Hello, Miss Weeder. Hey, Mr. Wait, Mr. Weeder. Hey, this is Ricky Caruth down at Eric Meehan's office at Keller Williams, La Jolla. How you doing? At whose office? Eric Meehan's down at Keller Williams. Who are they? The real estate company right here in La Jolla. Look, look I'm, I'm on the phone with somebody. I don't know what you want, but you'll have to call me back. I can't call you and speak to you right now. I got you, man. Hey, right. you have your good day. Right on to the next one, bro. Lucille. Lewis. Lewis. L yeah. Okay. Do you only call 55 and up communities? No. I, this okay. is just a really good area in San Diego, and I know it. Well. I guess, man. I mean, everybody's going to die where they're living in this neighborhood. By the way, guys. And I'll return your call later in the day. Are you going to cut it off? Bye. Yeah, I did. Okay. We're not leaving voicemails because that would just be weird, guys. But um, Eric did pick out this neighborhood. I had nothing to do with this. I don't know if I'd have picked out a 55 and up neighborhood. But I love a good challenge. Let's do this. The next one is Lean. Let's do it. She's dialing. Hello, you've reached Tony Lane. Please leave them. All right, go to the next one. 
on on to the next on on to the next this is i figured, I figured they'd be home they retired a lot of them have been so far yeah a little older than we wanted Hey, this is Art. Please leave me a message and I'll call you back as soon as possible. Thanks. Oh, next one. Hey, what is the weather like over there, by the way? <laughs> uh, it rained. It rained this morning and it's cleared up a little cloudy, about 65. Okay. Had some rain this morning, though, a little unexpected. Perfect. Perfect. Just need something to say. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I, I meant to tell you that before, but we were busy setting everything up. This is Charles Lynn. Now I got Robert Mann. Okay, Robert Mann. Hello, we are not available now. Please leave your All right, name. Next. I'm just going right to the next one. Man. Carolyn. Mm, man scar. Yeah. Hello. Hey, Miss Manscar. Hello. This? this is Ricky Carruth down at Eric Meehan's office at Keller Williams La Jolla. How you doing? I'm doing good. Oh, me too. I'm just glad that rain got out of here. Hey, I didn't want to take up too much of your time. There was a house around the corner from you that just sold. Didn't know if there's anything in the world we could do for you. No. Okay. Is there an agent that you would work with if you guys were to do something? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, look, I'm sure at some point you do something. Um, I'd like the opportunity to stay in touch with you. Would that be okay? No. Oh, man, why not? Well, I don't like your attitude. Oh, what did I do wrong? Well, you're just, you're just too pompous. <laughs> pompous? Yeah, I was just going to see what I could do to. I was just going to see what I could do to help you. You're just too much. You're, you're, you're just too much sure of yourself, aren't you? Not really. I'm. Well, see, you just keep arguing. Well, I was just calling to help you. That was it. Was that it? Okay. That's it. I'm sure, that was it. That was all there is to That's it. Just calling to see sure. to I'm see sure. see what in the world I could do to help you today. That's it. Okay, ma'am. You have you a good day. You have a good day too. No, I'll try. Okay. Bye bye. You try now. I will keep okay. trying. You have a good day. You have a good day too. I will have a better day than you. What an ass. Thank you. I hung up. Okay. <laughs> that was torturous. Wow. Okay. Well, I mean, really? dude, I'm, I'm there to help somebody, you know. She was laughing. I don't, I don't really know what her oh, problem. Yeah, no, it was it was it was a great call. To be honest with you, I feel like I really connected with her. To be honest, she seemed to just want to be playful for some reason. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. It was, it was good. To tell you the truth. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna send I'm her. I'm a, a little too sure of myself. <laughs> Yeah, 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 I am. I'm sure myself. Like the reason why I'm so confident is because I know why I'm here. I'm here to help people. I'm gonna go on yeah. the next one. The next one is Blair. Yep. Man. Too I never heard that one. Too confident. I, I don't know what to say. No, no, no. Here here's have you started the call? Don't start the call. Hello? Hello, Miss Blair? Who are you supposed to start the car? Hello? Who are you supposed to start the car? Oh, well, too late. How you doing? Uh, really bad when people like you call me. Well, you don't even know who I am or why I'm calling. Hello? Yeah, I'm up. Well, that's because you heard us talking before.
Yeah. What I was what I was gonna say is is that that here's here's the the entire punchline for this this entire experiment that we're doing, okay? Yeah. In my market, okay, of course, people do not communicate the exact same way as people do in San Diego or New York or Northern California or or you know Washington or DC or even other countries, right? But here's the kicker. It's it's figuring out how to communicate in those different areas. Yeah, sure. Maybe the exact same tone that I use here, the exact same doesn't work exactly the same way in your area. Yeah, I get that. That's not the punchline. The punchline is that relationships are universal. You know what I'm saying? They're right. universal uh, across the board. And so what our objective is, is to continue making the calls in whatever area that we are in and start to try to form and morph into and, and, and change up and adapt to the situation to figure out exactly how we do communicate with people in that area. For example, the lady that said I was pompous and stuff, you know, like I'm filling out the area. It would not take me long at all to make a few more of these calls, you know, like, I don't know, another day, another few calls a week. I don't know how long it would take, but it wouldn't take very long at all for me to figure out exactly how to communicate with these people and not and and call that person. And the same I could call that same person in two weeks. She is not going to remember my name at all. Right. I could call her back again in two weeks and have a second run at her um, with with a different formula of how I'm communicating and, and have formulated in a way that connects with her better or doesn't have her see me as such a confident person, which is what I thought people wanted. Right. But that's the part of the learning process of going through these calls. And that's why I'm doing this right now for everybody watching is to kind of prove to the point that sure, I understand there's different areas and people have different attitudes. You're not going to say the same thing to every single person, right. Based on where they are and what the attitudes are in the climate of the local markets, but it does work everywhere. You just have to make small little adjustments. Let's keep calling. Well, who's the next one? Watkins. Right. Let's see. It's uh, guys. Eric picked out a fifty-five and up community for me to call to. That'll be good. No, it's it is good. I like this. Hey, Miss Watkins. Yes. Hey, this is Ricky Carruth down at Eric Mann's office at Keller Williams La Jolla. How you doing? Fine. Good. I'm not interested. Oh, well, I wasn't. Okay. See, see right there, guys, like right there. The more and more you get of that, the more and more you try to figure out how to catch that off, cut that off at the pass. All right. I just learned something. Let's go to the next one. This is King, right? Yep. Hello. Hey, Miss King. Hello. Hey, is this Miss King? Hello. Who are you? This is Ricky Carruth down here at Eric Mann's office, Keller Williams. How you doing? What office are you at? Keller Williams. Right here. It's a real estate company here in La Jolla. And what do you want? Well, I was calling to see how you're doing. I was going to let you know a house around the corner sold. And I was just calling to see if there's anything in the world I could do for you. No. Uh -uh. It's, I'm not feeling good today. Yeah. So I'm not answering the phone anymore. Oh, okay. Good night. All right. Night, night. Sleep well. Okay. Okay. This is going to be Gilbertson. Yeah. Uh, 
Hello, we are not available now. Please leave your name and phone number at. All right, tree. Let's do this. Yes, I love this. <laughs> this is this is this is the most excited I've been in a good long while. Yeah, dude. Yeah, let's get my blood pumping. I need someone to view what you. Hello. Hello. Next. Yeah. Neeson. Neeson, got it. Thank you for calling. The person you're calling is not available. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's do it. Myers. Huh? Yeah. Why Myers? Hello, you have reached eight Next one. Sorry, we cannot take your call right You just got to conform, guys. I'll tell you one. We are unable to come to the phone right now. Please leave them. I'll tell you one thing. If I'm not scared enough to get on a live call and call people in San Diego, you sure as hell shouldn't be scared to call people in your lo local market that you know about. I'm looking at one single comp. I don't even know what the road is. I can't even pronounce the name of the road. I can't even pronounce the name of the road. I can't pronounce some of these people's names. I don't know what, I don't even, can't even pronounce the name of the road that they are on. So if anything else, this should give you guys motivation to at least make the calls if you're scared to make the calls. And realize that it's like, it's all about adapting to your environment and making people feel comfortable with you. This is an odd, this is an odd situation here with this 55 and up. I would say. Because a lot of these people, you know, they're in the mindset that this is their last, this is their forever home. Yep. You know. But that's okay. I just want to get on some phone the phone with some people and uh 
and show that this stuff works. Where are we at? Are we on? Are we calling? Yeah. What? What? Who's it on? Eight five eight oh, four seven two five four zero zero. All right. This is Bun Bunin. Becker. Becker. Well, this is good for me to see how you're doing. Handle adversity. Oh, yeah, dude. Absolutely. Adversity is like the mother of success. I thought I was better at it. <clears throat> the dialer is running. Somebody yep. cat called a cot. Call called a cot. Yeah, we're just running into a dry spell here. We got a lot of people that picked up though. We've talked to several. Yeah, sure. Six. Please leave a message at the tone. Thank you. Oh, next one. Swinsky. I see in the comments a lot of people saying they made making calls and getting all these listings and emails and stuff and how good it works. Yep. I see it all the time too. <laughs> it sometimes it motivates me, other times it's like, well, why aren't I getting it? Oh, this one lady, Sally says she's just for the rec. Is it dialing? They answered. Hello? Uh, go to the next one. And it's hard for you not to be able to see who's picking You got to tell me when it's dialing. It's dialing. Okay. I need to know. What, who is right. it? This is Herring. Okay. You're used to seeing when it's picked up. Hello, Miss Herring? Hey, this is Ricky Carruth down at Keller Williams La Jolla. How you doing? I'm not doing very well. I'm sick, so oh. I don't want to talk. Okay, I'm sorry to hear that. You get better now, all right? Yeah, I mean, these people are... Wow. Sally said, just for the record, she's old but not rude. <laughs> I actually wasn't saying old people are rude. What I was kind of meaning was is that most of these people see this as their forever home. It's dialing, just so you know, Hassan. Okay. You can't answer the phone right now. Leave a message and we'll call you. I paused it for a quick second too. So yeah, I mean, I used to do reverse mortgages, so I did a lot in this area. And usually this is their last home, you know, for the most right. part. Right. That's what I'm saying, man. It's kind of hard. Right. It's kind of hard. Like these people are not planning on buying or selling. Like they may run into the situation of, but like their initial, their initial mindset is that they're not looking to do anything. You know, they're, they're good. This is it for them. Kind of they're you know, they're in the mindset that this is it. Right. And I, 
you know, being in that <laughs> industry. Vicky says, now we know Ricky is a, is good at medical bedside manner. <laughs> I've worked with a lot of these, this type of clientele. I guess that's why I'm kind of drawn to it. All right, I'm down to the next one. Leggett and MK. Hmm, wish I knew what that meant. I don't know. Maybe leg it. Leg it. Leg it. Hello. We're unable to receive your call. Next one. Erwin? Okay. Yeah. You've reached eight five eight five nine two zero. All right, next one. Ellis. Yeah. Hello. Hey, Miss Ellis. Yes. Hey, this is Ricky Carruth down at Eric Meehan's office. Keller Williams. How you doing? Uh, uh, who are you with? Keller Williams here in La Jolla. You doing okay today? I'm sorry. Yes, I'm fine, honey. Okay, yeah. I was just. I are was you, just are you, oh, I didn't want to take up too much of your time. I just there was a house around the corner from you. You guys that sold. Just calling to see if there's anything in the world I could do for you. Oh, that's nice of you, but no, honey, we're not even close to wanting to sell. <laughs> but I'll keep you in mind. Okay. Is there is there is there an agent in the area that you guys work with? If you were to do something, no, I, we don't work with anyone, but okay. there's so many of them. Yeah. So oh, that's for sure. Okay. Hey, is it all right if okay. I stay in touch with you? Sure. What What's your email address? Like, what? I don't have one. All right. You have you a good we're day, ma'am. You too. All right. Bye bye. She says she doesn't have an email address. She's too old. Well, there is one on Mojo gives me emails, so I wrote down the name and number, and I'll check it out. I mean, later. you really, you really gave me some people to talk to today. <laughs> I mean, you gave me some people like answering the phone. <laughs> these people answer the phone like I'm sick. I can't. I can't film my face. I, you know, only <laughs> three million people in San Diego, so I didn't have For much. Sure. To For sure, right. we're dialing. Gary. Gish. Hi. You've reached the voice now of Gary Phipson with Hamlet Protein. All right. He's a he's a he's a real estate agent. <laughs> I should have left him a message. Bergmark. Oh yeah. Yeah, somebody said they noticed me change my tone. Yeah, I'm already morphing into the San Diego agent. Yeah, I I actually noticed it too. I'm telling you, dude, it's it's a it's it's a skill. It's a skill. You you figure out how to talk to people. Oh, please leave a message after the tone. Oh. It's dialing. Which one are we on? Uh, Bowman. Bowman. I don't even see. I heard a change in your. In okay, your... I I see it. Is this still Bowman? Yes.
Move to the next one, cleric. Cleric, cleric, cleric. Anton. Okay, got it. Hello? Hey, Miss Cleric. Yes? Hey, this is Ricky Carruth down here, Keller Williams, La Jolla. How you doing? Oh, good. Yeah, me too. Where, just what's that? Where did you say? Where did you say you're calling from? Keller Williams, right here, La Jolla. Why are you calling me? Well, I was just calling to let you know a house around the corner from you sold, and I was just calling to see if there's anything in the world I could do for you. Well, no, thank you. Okay. Is there an agent? No. Is there an agent in the area that you guys would work with if you were to do something? anything so okay when the time comes when the time comes we'll decide that i got you well i don't know would it be hard if i stayed in touch with you no there's no point in doing that i got you all right will you have you a good day ma'am okay thank you goodbye Bye. all right i got a five o'clock over here appointment so I got time maybe to try to get maybe one more live call on. All right. And then uh and then maybe Gary, we can Gary Kish. That's the same guy we called a while ago. That's a real estate agent. You sure? Yeah. All right. I'll skip him. That's why I was wondering right. the list. Wagner. This is Wagner. Wagner? Okay. Could have swore we called Wagner, but no, no, okay. Hi, you've reached the Wagner. Sorry, we missed your call. This is your name, Brick. Yeah, but I've learned to pick a, maybe a younger area. Yeah, that'd be smart, man. Maybe I should door knock these people. I don't know, man. I mean. Please leave your message for 8585. What do you mean? I'd almost even stay out of this subdivision. Okay. That's something different. Oh, there's plenty to pick from. Yeah, for sure. Kelly. Kelly. Not available now. Please leave your name and phone. Yeah, dude, you need to be hitting like people in their like 30s and early 40s, man. They're looking to like upgrade. They're still shaking and moving. You know what I'm saying? They're yeah. selling, they're buying, they're making it happen. I learned something. I appreciate it. This is Peggy. Yeah, I I uh I hear you. Okay. We are not available now. Please leave your. Okay, go ahead and shut it down and we'll chat for a second. Um, and then I got an appointment I got to be at. All right, it's done. So let's hear from you guys in the comments. Let me know what you think about this little experiment that, that me and Eric did today. Eric, what's your thoughts going in? Well, I, you know, I see a lot. Of, first of all, you bring a lot of energy no matter what you get even when they were, you know, the first one didn't start off so well. Um, I also just saw how you changed as you progressed. You know, things weren't going real well, but your inflections changed, your tone changed a little bit, and um, you just kind of, you know, went with the flow. So I learned that, and I also learned maybe about the areas that I'm, you know, calling too. Yeah. You know? mm -hmm. That's a big part of it. So I know that whole area is probably not something I want to call again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. I mean, seriously, like, okay, guys, this was totally unscripted. 
Um, Eric, literally, I called him at three o'clock to like start trying to figure out how we can do this. Um, and he picked the neighborhood beforehand. He sent me one comp. Uh, you know, none of these people, I mean, this is totally, this is real stuff here. This is realistic. This is, this is it. This is real life. Um, so I mean, what I got out of it was that I talked to probably six people, you think? Uh, more than that. It said that we connected with 10 and some of those are maybe two, but I think I actually maybe talked to maybe five or six, something okay. like that. But I mean, guys, five or six. Okay. I got about a hundred more to go before I can completely start to grasp the exact way I need to adapt into that market to make people feel comfortable with me. On top of the fact that we're talking to people who I'm telling you, these people think this is their forever home. This is, they're not going to buy or sell. This is in their mind. They may buy or sell later. They don't realize how long they have, but a lot of these people in these 55 and ups, they're not 55. They're like 70, mm -hmm. 80, you know what I'm saying? They're, they're even nineties. So, um, anyway, yeah, it's going to be a good area. What's that? I thought this was going to be a good area. No, it's okay, man. Like, like this is part of the process, man. You figure out what works, what doesn't work, what's more efficient, what's not as efficient, how to talk, what to say, everything, man. Everything's a learning experience. This was a huge win for everybody. This is a huge win for everybody watching. This was a huge win for you, for me, for everybody. Um, I appreciate it. Yeah, I mean it's it's all about learning. It's all about learning stuff. If I'm not learning, then I'm I'm done. Right. And every single thing I do is meant to help me learn something and for me to share with others what I'm learning and how I'm doing things. And uh, I think this was big today. So man, I really appreciate you reaching out and putting all this together and um staying yeah, on me. I appreciate you and everything you're doing for me and everybody else too. Thank you very much. For sure, for sure. And I will do this, guys, with uh I'll do this with other areas as well. I'm willing to get on the phone and do whatever it takes to show you guys that this is easy. There's nothing to it. It's okay to get hung up on or people get mad at you. None of that matters. What matters is that you figure out how to effectively communicate with people, right? And then do, and once you figure out, once you crack the code on figuring out how to communicate, then we got to go all in and give that to everybody that we can possibly give it to, to let them know who we are and spread that message of who we are to develop that database of people who know us, love us, like us, trust us, want to do business with us. Then that snowball starts to build, right? It's all about just doing right by people. So that's all I really got. Let me scroll through the comments real quick and see if anybody has any questions or anything. I see a lot of, let's see, let's see, let's see. I see a lot of positive comments here. So I really appreciate you guys so much. Um, I think that's it, guys. Let me just check one more thing to make sure there's no questions or anything, and then we'll get on out of here. Yep. That's it. I love you guys. I'll do this again. I'll call another area. Just get with me. We'll put it together. And uh, also, I want to make. I want you to make live calls with me. So if you guys want to do hashtag 321club on Instagram, just follow me on Instagram, hashtag 321club under all my posts as I post them for your chance to win either a coaching call with me, which I'll record, or live calls right here on my YouTube channel. I'll coach you through live calls. If you're not part of the free coaching program, 12,000 agents strong, that's at zero to diamond.com. Please subscribe to this YouTube channel and reach out. I answer every single DM on Instagram. Let me know if there's anything in the world I can do for you guys. We'll talk to you soon. Keep crushing it, make your calls and just get out there and help people put that work in later.